Hi, welcome to Move. My name's Greg, and this is your Strength Basic Series. In this particular workout, we're going to do total body. So you're looking for upper body, core, abs, all together in the one workout. It's just you and your own body weight. You might want a mat to put underneath you when we head to the floor. That's all you're gonna need. Let's get started. So we're gonna start with uh, some legs, just some basic squats. Starting with your feet, shoulder width apart. Turn the feet just out really slightly. The main thing is, is to get the weight back in the heels. Chest is lifted. We're going to take it slowly and sit the weight back and down and then push up. Now I'm gonna make sure that as you come up, you come fully to the top and release the hips right there. So you've got glutes and then get the release by pulling the hips through. It's not an exaggerated movement. You're just trying to come back to that neutral pelvic position with the spine, keep it nice and safe. All right, let's take a look at the knees. They should be tracking directly over the shoelaces. And then if you get the weight back in the heels, you're gonna get a really nice looking squat. Let's speed it up, pick up the pace. Drop down and up. Good, now what we're gonna do is I'm literally gonna split the body in half. We're gonna concentrate on the right leg only and lift the left leg. Are you ready? One squat, left leg lifts, same side. Good. So you can start to see, we've gone from what we call bilateral movement, two legs, to a unilateral movement with a single leg push up. And you're gonna to start to really feel that in the glute and the quad very, very soon, won't take long. Good, now the magic number is three. So we're gonna come down, we're gonna do three little pulses and then that lift, ready? Three pulse, so we go. Three, two, together, go. Three, two, one, together. Ah, oh, straight away. Can you feel the lactic acid build up in the leg? I wanna see the knee bend every single time. Go. Good, come on, just two more, two. One more time. Okay, now, you're gonna hold the balance here. Take it down, hold the balance on that right leg. This is gonna be our final finisher before we change legs. So if you're feeling a little bit of a burn, that's okay. Try and maintain balance. <laughs> Count of eight. That eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and release. Ah, oh, yes. Love it. Okay, you want the good news? We get to change legs. So, reset everything with the posture. Back to our bilateral movement. Two legs. Sit the squat. Let's go. Take it down. Okay, so, we're swapping over onto the left side. So, for the left side, you're looking at a left leg with a right leg lift. Do four more. For three. Okay, let's get the strength happening in this left leg. You ready? Squat now, lift up. Take it down. So you'll notice I always come back to that shoulder width position. And even though it's strength, it's also a lot of endurance. Using your muscles to overcome that lactic acid and push the repetitions out. When we're using body weight only, even though we call it strength, very much at the strength endurance end of that continuum. Ready? Three taps, go wide. Three, two, one, in the middle, squat, go. Now it's really a single leg squat. Have you noticed I'm up on the toe there? All that pressure remains in that left leg. Four more sets, here we go, four. Come on, sit low, three. I wanna see that knee bend every time. Go, bend. Bend, bend, sit. Nice. Okay, ready for that over deadlift? And we balance. So hold it. Square the shoulders, square the hips, ankle stability, knee stability, hip stability, right here. Got a count of eight, seven, six, five. Come on, hold tight. Three, two, one and release. Aye, shake it out. 
we shift the focus from squatting into lunging. Three types of squats, a forward, a lateral, and a behind, okay, or a reverse. So let's start with the front one. Place your feet directly under your hips. So imagine they're on train tracks. We're gonna step forward with the right leg now. Go. Take it down. Change to the left leg. Now with the right leg, lateral lunge. You're gonna keep the feet parallel. Go to the left. And you're gonna sit into it. Go to the back. Right leg down. Left leg down. Good. Can we speed that up? So two to the front. Go. Right leg, now go lateral to the right, lateral to the left, now reverse. Good. We're going to do one more time with that. Let's go. Two to the front, two to the side, two to the back. Come on, one more set. You can do one more. Let's go. Front, front, side, side. Come on, lean out onto that leg. Back, back. And give it a little shake. All right, I think that's enough for the legs in this short workout. Let's head downstairs and start with our push-ups on the knees, because we're in our basic series. If you want to take it to the toes, more than fine. How to do a good push-up? Hands go wide, chest in between the hands, nose out front. Two counts down, here. Push. And again, take it down. Lift. Nice. We're going to do eight, and then you're done for this set. Seven. Six. Come on, really pump it out. Three more. Two more. One more. Okay, hold that there. Bring your feet and knees in. Hands directly underneath. We're going to do a Superman, one side only, and this is a static hold. So the opposite leg, the opposite hand goes out, and we're going to hold that. Good. We've got about 20 seconds here, and then we've got one more set of the push-ups before we do the other side. Now really think about lengthening and stabilizing through your midsection. Come on, hold it, hold it, hold it. For four, three, two, one. And we're not going to the other side just yet. Eight big push-ups, and then we're going to the other side. Ready? Singles. Here we go. About eight, seven, six, five. Come on, push, push, push. Three, two, one. Hold it there. All right, let's go for the other side. So, Superman, leg out, arm up, 20 second hold. Let's do it. Come on, really stabilize. This one's a great one for your position and posture into the lower back, holding through the abs, it's core stability at its best. Really think about lengthening the front, lengthening the back. You are almost there in four, in three, in two, one, and release. Just sit it back, give it a nice stretch. So, a leg series, some push-ups, a little bit for core stability in the abs, and you, are officially done. See you next time.